Welcome to Nisho You and today we're going to build this mid-sized castle build and it is quite nice and uh, very uh, effective uh, in a way. So there is a pathway here and uh, there is some small gardens, some seeds are there. Obviously it is not a big big place to farm uh, but uh, we had a nice place here, another some, uh, some greenery. Uh, that will not normally not present in our build but uh, today I install a mod and for that reason there is some greenery so and this is a this is the main place where I always hang out because I am a foodie and I always prefer the food and these kitchen setup uh, very rigorously so that's that and then there is two floor that is separated by a portal and this is a first first uh, so first floor uh, it is sandwiched between this bedroom and um, bedroom and the main room and this is the bedroom this is very cozy only for uh, some some storage not a huge storage facility here but it is cozy and you can come here uh, put down your weapon and put her in your uh, armor and then some relax shave your bald head and all thing and that's it it is only for relaxation so now start building so when you start building uh, you need to make a grid and this grid going to be in some particular way we're going to send it like that so this is a um, this is a picture you can just uh, stop here and just make that layout it is quite easy uh, so uh, yes like all uh, all time I also forget to record that part so it is not a big problem it is just I'm just laying out those um, stones uh, stone pillar two by one stone pillar not stone pillar stone um, wall and I just lay out uh, within the uh, within the boundary of the uh, wooden structure or wooden layout so it is easy uh, I do it often and uh, so you can also easily um, replicate it it is not a big problem and these these part these circular semicircular part actually very important because this is going to be our uh, forging uh, settlement because it is separate from main building I don't like work um, and as you can see I I separate my life from work and um, for the reason I stop doing work until it is very 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 good like this time when I start making a video after three four days uh, so that's the reason I'm I'm just balancing my work like six hours work and everything else is my relaxation time and all that. So this is quite uh, quite easy to build. You just have to uh, follow the follow the um, layout and just complete that thing. And the main uh, the main problem here is this this particular building, this forge area. Uh, as you can already see here this semicircle one uh, this area is totally uh, detached um, from the main area or the main building and we're going to make some roofs and all that but you don't have to put any kind of boundaries or overlapping any kind of st structure there so it is totally separated and uh, as you can see I erect some pillar iron iron beams and that will actually help us uh, erect the stone structure higher and obviously i'm going to modify some of them as you can see <laughs> later on uh, because there is some problem here and there um, for load bearing capacity and all that so there's the reason so uh, just fill the blanks there is going to be two uh, two door uh, in face to face so this is the main door and 
this and there is the entrance main entrance uh, so there is two two doors side by side here this is a small part and also similar to the um, similar to these uh, these uh, forging area also going to have similar similar thing and this is the front part of the front part of the building or uh, roof roofed building roofed part so we have to put some uh, uh, firework or uh, so fireplace so first what I think is in making an inside one but uh, later on my as per the as per the reference drawing as you can see or uh, you always use reference drawing from other people and uh, not other people actual building or any um, any reference drawing from um, artist or any kind of artist uh, so not from any um, youtube video for Valheim because they already built it so it is nothing special to build similar building or similar thing uh, again and again and again so for that uh, for that reason i i really uh, like to uh, uh, get inspired from uh, different artists and uh, different illustrator and so we make a makeshift half size or uh, open open one side open um, fireplace so this is quite easy to build uh, just I have some problem making it properly but you are better than me you can easily build that you know, with easy you are not going to face that much problem that I had so as you can see it is actually quite um, work quite well uh, and now we have to put some uh, uh, what is this? This is floor. So floor. Let's say it's not possible. And now we're starting start building the roof, and it is quite easy for building the roof. Um, if you if you take the dimension correctly, or if you choose the dimension correctly, you don't have any problem, or you are not going to face any problem. Here yeah, and this is quite okay. Mm. Actually, not quite okay. Actually, it is. Uh, it is coming. The shape is almost similar to what I expected. So that's a good, that's a good thing and. Similarly, we complete the second half, second part of the building and second wall. And now some changes. We are going to extend the roof. And uh, the main reason of extending the roof is just not to look good, uh, but also provide some roof on the top of the uh, top of the um, fireplace. So you can see. If there is rain, yeah, actually affect the fireplace, but not now. After putting proper shelter or proper um, shade, and the back side of the building also similar, make like it, make, make it like that, and it is quite easy. Obviously, I'm going to skip a lot of part uh, here and there because uh, it's going to be a huge, huge um, video. Um, so I'm going to skip a lot of part, but obviously, I'm going to show the most of the, the important part beforehand. Uh, so, like this part, this extended, extended part, uh, which is actually problematic and for. Uh, for this particular um, part, uh, I have to do it s slightly differently. Mm. So I need some windows here and there. Yes. 
so as you can see i i am actually uh, pressing shift and then placing that and so it's actually uh, placed uh, midway and not uh, either uh, front or back so it is slightly mid section so it is actually quite good because uh, loop wise it's not that bad uh, and now we're going to cover the roof for that second part of the building this is the this is the part where, which is uh, actually uh, right angled with the main building <coughs> Or the uh, front part so similar ways uh, we are going to uh, cover it up so that's it and now we're going to put some stone wall here uh, if you have any kind of problem here uh, if you face any kind of problem just Place some one meter, one by one meter uh, stone wall, and it's actually works quite well. Uh, if you have any problem, but either otherwise, you can just continue what I just did right now. So now the, there is problem of uh, placing these um, roofs, not roof, these uh, stone wall, because alongside of these two particular vertical uh, vertical column uh, the stone the iron iron column it is quite easy to uh, place the uh, stone but uh, if you if you move slightly like this one these extended one meter extended one uh, it's actually becomes quite problematic so uh, for that particular reason we need to put another set of uh, vertical wall, vertical um, iron beam but we're going to do it later so what i first do is make a extended part like that uh, so it is structure it actually uh, provides some support here but uh, later when i increase the height of the building it's actually uh, Actually, I face some problem, so well, where we have to uh, make some extension. Okay, it's quite good. And normally, I do these uh, do do this kind of building uh, not uh, multiple time. Not normally, not multiple time. Uh, if it is uh, if it is doable in one one way or not means one way means uh, in one go you can say it is it is quite easy so uh, for that reason I tried to build it in one go not uh, destroying five or ten times uh, and then uh, make it make a proper video about that. So it is just free flowing. You are just making some mistake along, along the way. But that is the fun of building anything in Valheim or any game. But Valheim is particularly much better. So you're just what you are doing right now. It's just main part of the building, the fourth, fourth part. You are just increasing the height, and uh, now you are covering the base uh, actually there is some problem here placing this actually this is a uh, these uh, floor piece actually uh, slightly bit slightly bit problematic because it's uh, length actually not matched with any anything uh, around this building so it is not uh, uh, it is slightly down uh, half meter down around half meter down from the uh, from the base so that's actually makes a problem here but don't worry we can do it easily so place some vertical beam like that and connect it and then connect these two like that so this is looks like this 
and actually it's um, it is not a problem it's not a big problem if you're not going to make the tower bigger if you don't want to do that you can just uh, keep it small it's actually works quite well but if you wish to make it much bigger uh, then you have to provide that particular um, uh, iron beam structure you need to provide that right. a lot of work actually may I skip some part the main video actually um, if I show everything it is almost like four hours video so i think you don't have that much yes i have to wait uh, i have to just wait for that um, uh, stone stone uh, wall to just change color to from a green to red just to see how i am doing right now so it is quite easy in that way so that's all building uh, main building is completed the uh, entrance will also completed so we're going to finish up the uh, finish up the uh, floor so because of the floor is slightly down from the baseline so that's the main reason we're going to uh, use uh, reference from uh, from one side to another uh, so our so our base can looks actually uh, nice so one meter one meter wall uh, take as a reference and now i put the stone structure it is actually slightly pr problematic you can make it uh, similar height to the um, similar height to the um, base structure or base uh, and it actually works quite well now we are going to put the stone arch we are going to put it not uh, not over the uh, over the door frame but uh, other side of the door frame uh, so we can place these 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 tiles this stone floor and it's actually very very easy you can also use some iron beam iron uh, the cage cage uh, floor actually this one you can use uh, iron cage or uh, this cage floor and you can easily cover it up with uh, stone floor it is also very easy to do what I am just doing right now similar to the other thing we are going to cover it up with with the cache floor and this is a default uh, I am going to use these and slightly shift and then cover it up so uh, the, the ugly iron uh, the ugly cage floor doesn't uh, show from the downstairs downstair and go after completing all of this all of the flooring or this roof actually stone roofing I think we need to put some decoration and so we're making this particular design what I normally do with stone structure I think it is nothing special it is just giving some uh, depth in the building these are the these are the decoration this is also some part of decoration uh, these port look whatever it is actually I don't know what is called uh, my English is not that good but uh, as you can see this is a fort looking thing and we are going to make some windows here and there because previously we are not providing some windows because it is actually uh, problematic so make 
some windows uh, first hand and it is quite easy to make it later so we decided to do that uh, so so it is almost complete what i need to do is uh, make some make some floor and this floor is this far, uh, this is a top floor the this is the bedroom actually so we're going to make the bedroom where the windows are situated so after that place we are going to oh yes we have to drop down and then make a secret base uh, not secret base secret uh, uh, area which can be accessible through a through a portal so the first floor and the bed so these are the two floor you can access through the portal and now we are going to finish up with some storage and all that and that's the video it is quite easy video so don't worry you can easily do that not no tricks uh, nothing special extraordinary just i am going to share with you what i make it is it is quite easy quite nice quite beautiful and only one more record if you don't wish to put those uh, trees and all that you can just keep those out and do it yourself thank you see you next time bye bye